There are 112 criminal proceedings against officials of the territorial recruitment centers. 33 suspects, regional, city, and district military commissars, employees of the military medical commissions, abuses in different regions. Some took cash, some took cryptocurrency. That's the only difference. The cynicism is the same everywhere. Illicit enrichment, legalization of illegally obtained funds, illegal benefit, illegal transportation of persons liable for military service across the border. We are dismissing all regional military commissars. Look, I think it's possibly directed at the fact that in the United States, more than anywhere else, people are saying, yeah, but I mean, where did all that money go? Why do we not even know how much of that money that was originally set aside? Where is it? And now it wants more. How much have we spent? And so I think it's partly an effort to say, oh, we're in fact cracking down on corruption. But really, I mean, Ukraine is probably the biggest criminal event that we have seen in this century of money laundering, of corruption going right up to the top, of diversion of weapons and of simple stealing of money and transferring it over abroad. It is a huge boondoggle.